Today, we will discuss some numerical questions on the price elasticity of demand. Let's move on to the first one. Consider the demand for a good. At a price of Rs 4, the demand for the good is 25 units. Suppose, the price of the good increases to Rs 5. And, as a result, the demand for the good falls to 20 units. Calculate the price elasticity. So here. First, let's have a look at the initial price and initial quantity demanded. The initial price is Rs 4 and the initial quantity demanded is 25 units. The new price is given as Rs 5 and new quantity demanded is 20 units. The formula for the price elasticity of demand is the ratio of the percentage change in quantity demanded with the percentage change in price. So, it is delta Q by Q divided by delta P by P, which is delta Q by delta P into P by Q. From the original price and the new price, we need to calculate the change in price. The change in price will be rupees 4 minus rupees 5, that is the original price minus the new price, which is minus 1. The change in quantity demanded will be 25 minus 20, which is 5 units. So, substituting it into the formula, that is delta Q by delta P into P by Q. Here, delta Q or change in Q is 5 and delta P is minus 1. P represents the original price and Q represents the original quantity. Hence, it will be 5 divided by minus 1, which is delta Q by delta P into 4 by 25, which is original price by quantity. That is 5 by negative 1 into 4 by 25, which equals negative 0 0.8. This is a negative number as price and quantity demanded have an inverse relationship with each other. It has to be noted that here EP or 0 0.8 when taken in absolute value is less than 1 and greater than 0, which implies that the demand is less elastic. Now, let's move on to another question. Consider the demand curve VP is equal to 10 minus 3P. What is the elasticity at price 5 by 3? Here, VP is nothing but quantity demanded. So, we can find out what is the amount of quantity demanded from this equation. Q is equal to 10 minus 3P is equal to 10 minus 3 into 5 by 3 as P is given as 5 by 3. This is equal to 5. So, now we have the price and quantity demanded. We need to find out delta Q by delta P. We can find this out by simple differentiation from the equation Q is equal to 10 minus 3P dq by dp or delta q by delta p is equal to minus 3. We get this result because when we differentiate q with respect to 10, we get 0 as 10 is constant. When we differentiate q with respect to minus 3p, we get minus 3 into 1 as the differential of q with respect to p is 1. So, it will be 0 minus 3 which is minus 3. Substituting the formula for elasticity here, we get Ep is equal to delta Q by delta P into P by Q, which is minus 3 into 5 by 3, which is P divided by 5, which is Q, which is minus 3 into 5 by 3 divided by 5. So, we get minus 3 into 5 divided by 3 into 1 by 5, which is minus 1. This implies that the quantity demanded is unitary elastic. We will solve one more question in this video. The question is, suppose the price elasticity of demand for a good is minus 0.2. If there is a 5% increase in the price of the good, by what percentage will the demand for the good go down? Here, EP is given as minus 0.2. It is given that there is a 5% increase in price so, the percentage change in price is given. EP is nothing but the percentage change in quantity demanded divided by the percentage change in price. So, substituting the information which is available for us in the equation, we get minus 0.2 or EP is equal to percentage delta Q divided by 
percentage delta p which is 5. So, percentage delta q is equal to minus 0 0.2 into 5 which is minus 1. This implies that the demand for the good would fall by 1 percentage. I hope that these numericals are clear. Thank you.